Ambition has always been a revered trait in Chinese culture, and that trait is showing its colors as China prepares to make the world's tallest building and in just 90 days. That would be setting two world records and doing it in a fraction of the time it took to build the One World Trade. A company in China named Broad Sustainable Building Corporation has taken on the building project. The tower will be called Sky City One when it's completed, and by the sound of the name, there'll be more to follow. CEO Zhang Yiwei first announced its grand mission one year ago, and if it's given the go-ahead from the government, construction will begin in November. So how are they going to complete a 220-story building in such a short amount of time? The answer is prefabricated parts. A prefabricated building is assembled on-site from several factory-built units. So essentially, it's like assembling a building from IKEA instead of making one from scratch. Using this method, Broad was able to build a 30-story hotel in just 15 days. After its completion in 2012, the hotel passed the national safety test and could supposedly withstand a 9-magnitude earthquake. Sounds like a miracle technique, right? Not only does it use less resources, but it's much cheaper than other building methods. So what's the problem, then? Authorities have withheld permits for Sky City One because of safety, congestion, and environmental concerns. For one, prefabricated skyscrapers are a relatively new concept, and it just doesn't seem like a good idea to apply it to the world's tallest building without some more test runs. It's also important to note that these buildings, while very stable vertically, are less so when it comes to lateral forces. So a very strong wind could potentially topple the building if there's redundant structures or if the core is not solid enough. Zhang Yue has reportedly designed new structures to solve this issue, and with an estimated 30,000 residents, I hope it is. Leave your comments below, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more.